My mustache is bothering me. Don't you hate it when your mustache hairs just get a little bit too long and start to go inside your mouth? It's a little. Just a little. <gasps> Out of my mouth! <gasps> I'm trying to tell you. <gasps> it's just right in the corner. Ah! Ah! <laughs> okay, that's too much aggravation. <laughs> You know My what it is. Mouth is you. Hey, you. Everybody you. shake your stuff. Let's go. Let's go. The rebel's here and he's big time. Can't just make it disappear at will. Man, that'd be awesome. A mustache that disappeared at will. Perfect master of disguise. Especially if you can make it reappear. I mean, either one's cool, but both would be fantastic. That'd be like. X-Men style superpowers. <laughs> I can change the weather. What can you do? Um, have control of my facial hair. <laughs> I have unlimited control of my facial hair. Just facial hair? Yes. What about pubic? I'm not telling. <laughs> yes, that's how the conversation between Mustache Man and Rogue goes in, uh, in my, what is it called, DC universe? What universe is X-Men? I forgot. DC, must be DC, right? Marvel? It's not Marvel. Ugh, such a terrible person! I don't know the difference. I just don't know anymore. Leaves! Whoa, this guy's gonna knock some people out. What's that? Oh, music. <laughs> I forgot there was music playing in my ears. What's that odd drumming sound? Somebody come at me. I'm hearing drumming. Damn mustache hair. You rogue hair, you. Okay. I'm just getting used to having an intercom in my helmet, and this boom mic, I think that's what it's called, a boom mic, right? Anyway, it's the microphone, which has a semi-rigid, <laughs> set rigid, a semi-rigid flexible thing. <laughs> it's not like just on the line, so it's just kind of hanging there. Anywho, the mic is on my lips like I mean I'm not making out with a thing but if I purse my lips to kiss like that my lips purse out then I can then I'm, I'm really kissing the mic I'm yep just kiss the mic I just kissed you mwah <laughs> push it forward I'm, I'm now using my tongue uh, that's the sound of my tongue oh uh, yeah oh uh, yeah And this track, ladies and gentlemen, comes from my focus playlist. So when you wanna do some work or read or something and just really need a focus. Binaural beats. chilly here in China. <laughs> the whole China! The whole country. It's all like this. That's how China rolls. Communist, com <laughs> communist to the core. Ah! It's okay. We survived! Camera's off. You're off, buddy! Off the wall! <laughs> Who's on the wall, really? So, I mean, wouldn't that be crazier? Off the wall or on the wall? I think it'd be crazier if you're on the wall. But isn't that like a definition of a crazy person? Somebody that's hanging out on the wall. Who does, who does that? Who's on a wall? Nobody. Nobody's on a wall. Normal people are off the wall. Normal people are off the wall. 
So why do we use that as a crazy... He's off the wall! Is that... Is that... Uh, is that a saying? Maybe I've forgotten sayings in my life. <laughs> Maybe I'm saying... He's off the gazebo. No, that's not right. Uh, off the chair! Yeah, see, that makes sense. Off the chair is something that's crazy. A person sitting down calmly and quietly on a chair. It's not crazy at all. Everybody knows that. Just normal chair sitters. neighborhoods and uh, yeah that's a burp and they just cook down here in what would normally be like a garage or something uh namian anjo namian yeah so i eat a lot uh namian namian jia ji dan yes i don't sound like too much of a crazy person talking to myself Captain Kirk to home base. I have infiltrated the enemy and I'm eating amongst them now. They are a strange race. None of them wear helmets. They make noodles by pulling them. How strange. I've ordered a dish and hopefully I'll survive. Who knows what strange animals they're cooking up. Okay, enough crazy time. All right, camera test number two. I've tilted it up slightly, and it's in English now. Try to update the firmware, but no! Cena doesn't want to do it! I updated the... What's that? It's not update. It's called a restore. I did a firmware restore. And then try to do the firmware update, but it's like, no, I don't want to update. Meh. Meh, 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 meh. <sighs> Just like that. That's exactly how the Cena program sounds when it's updating. Meh. Meh. 15%? Meh. We can't do it. 22%? Meh. Still can't do it. Whatever. All right, so, motor vlog number two, coming to you from Zhejiang, China. Listening to some funky, funky town, funky music. I realize this may not be very comfortable for you watching, but dang, I just can't help myself. Here we go. got a beer waiting for me. <laughs> I've got a beer waiting for me at home. Alright, I know how crazy I'm gonna sound because big deal, it's just a beer. No! Not just any beer. 
It's a Chimay. Oh, yeah. And also a Trappiste. Oh, yeah. Uh, I believe it's like a Chimay 8, which is not 8%. It's like a 10%. And then... Oh, no, no, it's a Trappiste. Trappiste 8, 10%, and a Chimay Blue. Also around uh, 8 or 9 percent. So here's the thing. In China, beer is kind of hard to come by. You have to be in a major city to get a normal selection of beer. Otherwise, it's just... Uh, whoa! Whoa there, buddy! Anywho. Uh, I was talking about beer. Yeah. Beer in China... It's not like a very common thing to get a large selection of beer. It's they have their own Chinese beer and Chinese beer is 2.5%. Yes, it's half the beer that the rest of the world is used to. The rest of the world drinks 4.5% standard. It's quite normal. Corona, Budweiser, Dos Equis, Hefenweizen, actually Hefenweizen are 5 by standard. Anywho, I've been here several years, and there are imports. There are Coronas, there's Heineken, and Budweiser. Those are your three choices for import beers. Everybody here is all about the Budweiser. Like, that's like, because it's an import, so it's more expensive. <laughs> and I'm always offered a Budweiser whenever I go out. By the way, offering beer to people is normal uh, in China. So I'm offered, you know, oh, hey, here's some Budweiser, and I have to always <laughs> kindly refuse and be like, no, I'm sorry, my stomach can't handle shitty I feel like a douche when I say it, and it kind of is a douchey thing to say. You know. But, about a year ago, in this small town where I live, they finally opened a beer store. Yeah. Where's my beer? Here's my beer. Oh, <laughs> 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 